Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm bringing you a uh, an NHL jam mode. People really like this, um, and I like this, so why not, right? Uh, let's get into it. We're gonna, uh, basically we're gonna go through um, a fantasy draft and see what we have, what kind of team we have, and decide whether we want to go for a championship team right away a rebuilding team and just pick out a bunch of young guns uh, so that we will be just fantastic for the future or if we want to draft one individual player and build around him so uh, what's your GM name uh, my name is Brayden so we'll put that um, we're gonna do a fantasy draft uh, and my favorite team is the Montreal Canadiens. Might get shit from some of you for that, but it's the way it is. Rules and settings. Uh, fantasy draft on. My difficulty superstar. Trade difficulty on easy, because the computers are assholes to trade with. All that's on. Draft pick. Yep, yep. Alright. Salary cap on, and we'll start salary cap on so we can keep it as realistic as possible um, so we have seventh pick overall that's pretty good uh, we'll start the draft see who was picked at first who do we have Sidney Crosby first Carey Price second yeah that makes sense the two of them Weber third Taves Tavares is a high franchise Doughty. All right, so it's our pick. He's after us. We're the only Canadian team up here. Oh, Vancouver. Okay. Um. So I've, I've, um, I've made a lot of the players' attributes to what they are now in the NHL right now. So, for example, Cam Atkinson from the Columbus Blue Jackets. I've upped him to an 89 from an 82 or whatever he was before um, just because I think that's what he deserves uh, n like not just him I've upped a lot more players like I brought down Zdeno Chara uh, brought down his overall brought down Dion Phaneuf I've added players like uh, Nico Heischer I've up Nolan Patrick's um, potential because he always pans out like shit for some reason which I have no idea why um so, I think we're just going to sim the entire draft and see what we're dealing with and see where we're going to go from there and see what other teams have. Simulate fantasy draft. Yes, please. Alright. So, fantasy draft is now complete. We'll go take a look at who we got. So, we took Stammers, 7th overall. He seems to be... He seems to go pretty much around there all the time. Then we've got McKinnon. So two number one centers. That might be a problem for the future. Then we got Big Buff at the point. Okay. Mikhail Bodker. The Goose. Carl Alsner. Another solid defenseman. Milan Goonchic. <laughs> uh, Cam Ward. So might have to look for a better goal here maybe get a young one and, and uh, grow him because Cam Ward almost had his expiry date Radko Gudas he's a Guna I actually hate Radko Gudas Braden Coburn Carl Soderberg Michael Camilleri hey I love Mike Camilleri Bo Bennett Lewis Connaughton Philip Grubauer so that's probably going to be our Backup goalie. Uh, Yarncroft, Glendenning, Carrick, Raymond, Poolin, Bergman, Maloche. I don't really see any any uh, young guys, really young guns on our team, which is kind of disappointing. Um, so we'll just we'll just check out the top five or so and uh, the other team's picks. Nashville. We got Keith, Latang, Kessler, Horvat, Truba, that's a decent squad. New Jersey, Taylor Hall. 
Same team, Joe Pavelski, Tyler Johnson, Burakovsky, and Eric Johnson. Wow, that's gonna be that's gonna be a team that scores a lot of goals. The Islanders, you got Johnny Quick, Brett Burns, Rick the Dick Nash, Michael Granlin, Severson. That looks like a pretty well-rounded team. Rangers, Doughty, Wheeler, Galchenyuk, Defoli, Kuznetsov. You see Vasilevsky in there. Tarasenko, Carter, Eichel, Fowler, uh, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Hurdle, wow, Panarin, that's going to be a dangerous team soon, this set as well, uh, uh, Johnny T, Jeff Skinner, Doug Hamilton, Anderson Muzzin, so this is probably going to be a bottom 10, bottom 5 team in the league here, I see a couple prospects though, Hicketts, uh, we got Garbajowski in here, uh, Matthew Barzell, we got Pittsburgh, we got Tyler Sagan, McDavid, wow, Johnny Goudreau, wow, that's going to be a, just a dangerous team soon, holy, Sagan and McDavid and Goudreau, uh, Shucks, we got Weber, Shifley, Gibson, Kreider, uh, that's a decent team, Blues, we got Rene, Backstrom, Vlasic, Steen, Jack Johnson. Um, that's probably going to be a bottom feeder team right there. Tampa Bay, we got Freddie Bluetooth, Anderson, uh, Shattenkirk, Sean Couturier, Noah Hannafin. Wow, he's taking 91? That's pretty early. Pasternak, I also up Pasternak because he's having a pretty good year, like 20 goals, I believe. Um, Toronto, who do we got in here? Ekblad, uh, Voracek, Bukestad, Strom, Kucherov, Brig Shan, Jonathan Bernie. They brought that duster back. <sighs> That's a rough one. Cool, we got Carey Price, Morgan Riley in front of him, Andre Barkov, okay. These guys are going to be a pretty defensive team. Might have a hard time scoring goals, though. Cavs, we got Getzlaff, Giroux, Simmons, Eberle. Hmm. Don't really see any tendies in there, though. Like, Halak, nah, he's, he's, he's kind of a bum. Jets, McDonough, Malkin, Oshie, Lindholm. Caudry, the Nuge, Camp Tyler, they're going to be a pretty good team. Uh, Anaheim, Petrangelo, Corey Schneider, Evander Kane, Stahl, Neal, that looks like a pretty good squad. Coyotes, we got PK, Subban, Bergeron, Jonathan Druin, Ryan Murray. They got both Subans on there, okay. They got the goalie Subban, the brothers, Jurgensen. We got the Bruins. Rask. <laughs> Rask went back to the Bruins. Haven't you learned your lesson, Rask? Uh, Larkin, John Carlson, Ryan O'Reilly. I actually think Ryan O'Reilly's such an underrated player. And he's actually not. Like, you look at this man and you think this guy's 30, 35. He's actually like 25, 26. He's going to be like. Oh, fucking Buffalo's going to be such a threat in a couple years. Johnny Taves, Mark Andre Fleury, Geo Forsberg, Cam Atkinson. That's an all right team. Calgary, Jamie Ben. Jesus, he is having one rough year. I think he's got 10 goals so far, and this time last year he had 24 or something like that. OEL, uh, Lokacher, Corey Crawford, Stalhosa, Cody Eagle. Wow, it's going to be a good team. Carolina, Suter, oh jeez, they picked Suter, he's a good player, but he is on your team for life, you are not getting rid of that contract, same with Parise, Dubnik, Palat, okay, yeah, that looks like a pretty good squad, the Blackhawks, Eric Carlson, Wenberg, uh, Marchand, I give him a bit of a boost, Steve Mason, he went before JVR? Wow. 
Oh, geez, they got some good young guns on this team. Um, Brian Pollock, Sam Bennett, Athanasui, Daniel Sprong, Connor Carrick. Wow. Also, I really bumped down uh, David back as I think I put him down to an 82. He was at like an 88. That is not deserving. Oh, geez, he got some firepower out of Colorado. Ovi, Pajaretti, DeShane, Krejci. Holy. That is going to be a team that scores a lot of goals, but lets in a lot of goals as well. They also got Joel Erickson, Ack, Willie, Nylander. Wow. They're going to be... They're going to be scoring a lot on that team. Columbus, Patty Kane, Lundqvist, Falk, Boone Jenner, Nick Foligno, both returning. Um, Mike Hoffman, Strong. That looks like a pretty, pretty decent team. They got some They got some really good prospects. Wow, Provorov, Declare, Richie, Gauthier, G uh, Ghost. Holy. They are looking for the future. And also the present. Holy. Kopitar, Landeskog, Ogposo, Ole Mata. Nail the fail Yakupov. Going at 153rd. What a bust he was, eh? First overall. Braden Holby got picked 9th. Wow. Uh, Kessel, Yetiberg, Jonas Brodeen, Tyson Bear. Yeah, it's a pretty defensive team. Uh, Edmonton. Perry, Rancher Hayes. It's not too bad. They might be a bottom feeder team. Bottom 10. Uh, now for Florida, Victor Hedman, Semyon Varlamov, Kyle Turris, uh, Schwartz, Dumba. They're going to be a bottom feeder team for sure. And now number one overall, Sid the Kid. Seabrook, Parise, Jesus, him and Crosby are both on some diesel contracts, I mean Crosby's worth it, but Parise, no way buddy, Mitch Marner went 181th, wow, that's early, um, we got in the wild here, Roman Yossi, Bobrovsky, Stahl, Domi, I gave Domi a bit of a bump just because I like him and I liked his dad, Kirby Reichel, Vatman, uh, Fabry, Sorelli, wow, Zaka, holy, Zach for Cali, wow, they got some young guns on this team, also really demoted Andrew Lack, he is having just a shit year, like a dog shit year in, uh, on the Islanders, so he went, he went 384th, which is pretty deserving in my opinion, so, this is the squad we're dealing with out here. Um, based on the guys we have and that, I don't think we're a, a cup contending team as we are. I mean, I think we can make the playoffs, uh, maybe the seventh or the eighth seed, but I don't think we'll be going far. So I think our best option here is to not do a full on rebuild. But either build around Stammers or Nathan McKinnon. Uh, we'll probably end up building around Stammers because he's already better. And I don't see me really getting anybody. Like, Stammer has a ton of trade value. And if I were to trade Stammer, I would want a really good winger um, or a young guy. And I don't see myself getting that. So we'll check out who we have for free agents here. Yeah, me Yeager. <laughs> uh, got all the old guys here. Iggy, Markov, Shane Doan. What do we have for two-way? Check out potential. A uh, 22-year-old top nine, eh? I could probably offer him a contract. He's 67 though. Um, probably not actually. 